Hey guys, Troy from the Do-It-Yourself World and the Off-Grid Project. This is going to be a very short and simple video on how to uh, connect your solar power battery banks. Now what I've done so far is connected one half already, and then I stopped, and then I connected two batteries together. Now I don't have a tripod anymore. I have to go in and find a place to get one. I'm in a small town now, for those of you that haven't followed along. I just moved, my wife and I just moved to the country, and my tripod's broke, so forgive me, but I'm going to do a very simple, short video on how to connect your battery banks. So what I've got here, in this example, are 6-volt golf cart batteries. If your batteries are 12 volts, then skip this part and go on to the next step, but please do follow through so you don't miss anything anyway. If you have 6 volt golf cart batteries and you're wiring them up in a 12 volt system as I am doing, then you have to connect them together in series, two batteries together in series to give you 12 volts. So 6 battery, 6 volt battery plus a 6 volt battery gives you 12 volts combined. All I've done right here looking at two batteries is connected the positive of one to the negative of another. All right, A 6 volt plus 6 volt gives me 12 volts from the positive and the negative. Here 12 volts out combined. So now this one is my positive terminal of my new battery and that's the negative terminal of my new battery, the two combined. Here I have the same thing. I connected the positive of one battery to the negative of another give me a combined 12 volts battery. So now I have two batteries at 12 volts. Now the next step, you've got them combined and you've got 12 volt batteries, is to combine them in parallel to increase the current. So now what I've done here to co connect them in parallel, I've got my two batteries connected here. This is a 12 volt battery and here's a 12 volt battery. Okay, Connected plus to minus, plus to minus. All right, Give me two 12 volt batteries. And if, if I'm boring you with this being very simple, please forgive me, but some people uh, will probably appreciate uh, the repetition and the time I'm taking on this to clarify. So then I, I'm taking and connecting them in parallel. So to connect two 12 volt batteries in parallel, you connect positive to positive with one wire, negative to negative with another wire. You will notice I have taken off my ring my wedding ring is off and I have no jewelry. Do not wear any jewelry. I don't care how, how much you love your wife. Don't wear any jewelry, especially if you love your wife. Because blowing off your ring finger would not be cool. Anyway, take off any jewelry. Don't have any dangling things on your neck or any zippers or things on your, on your sleeves when you're working like this for safety. So now we have a battery bank is what it's called. The four individual batteries combined are now a battery bank at 12 volts okay we've got two 12 volt batteries combined giving us a still a total of 12 volts but now we have a combined current we had 225 amp hours each over here when I combine the two 225 amp hour batteries I had when you when you combine them in series the amp stays the same, the current stays the same, but the voltage is added. So you've got now 6 plus 6 is 12 volts, but still only 225 amp hours. When I combine them in parallel, I've now combined 225 amp hours plus 225 amp hours. Gives me 450 amp hours capacity at 12 volts. So I hope that's clear and simple. Now I'm going to combine the these guys in the system. So I want to go minus to minus to minus all together and plus to plus to plus all together. And we'll be back in a minute. We'll have one large battery bank. Okay, now I have one large battery bank at 12 volts. So there's a battery at 12 volts. There's one. There's one. And there's one. And then I combine them all together 
plus to plus to plus to plus and minus to minus to minus to minus. So now I have one large 12 volt battery bank and that's how simple it is. Now for how to connect them to your devices that's going to be in a separate video when I connect my solar charge controllers. I'm going to keep this series very short and very simple and step by step. So that's it guys. That's how you connect your batteries together to increase voltage or to increase current or in this case both. So now I have 450 plus 450 I have well 225 times 4 basically I now have 900 amp hours a battery capacity all combined. There you go guys, how to connect your batteries. Troy from the do-it-yourself world and the off-grid project.